Hey guys, Silence here here. We are back in Uta Macross once again because there is a brand new gacha banner and let's get straight into it because it reveals one of Cheryl's most revealing costumes ever. Um, so I guess a lot of the Cheryl fans are very excited for it. Uh, I myself, uh, I'm okay with it. I'm not ex explicitly excited because Cheryl is not my waifu but still uh, I can get why some of the Cheryl fans are excited. Anyway guys, let's take a look at Cheryl's new episode plate. Uh, total score of 3,462. It's very high, um, almost to the top tier in terms of total score. Focusing on voice and charm. Wow, okay. So the four divas that are equipable with this episode plate. Center skill, your star element plates, total will be increased by 30% up. So a pretty awesome um, center skill if I have to say. Active skill, life recovery of 30%. Uh, pretty okay, not the best percentage, but that's fine. Life skill support, score and damage. So when you hear score and damage, it basically means the same thing. At the 48 second mark for 16 seconds, every second you will lose 20 uh, health and of course you gain a percentage boost of 100% for your score. So both Basara and um, Cheryl's plates are support plates surprisingly, so nothing towards the active skill uh, score boosting percentage. Um, so I guess you will have Cheryl and Basara at your, as your side divas with these plates if you have obtained them with lots of luck. And of course have another uh, diva in the center position with an active skill that boosts maybe 100% in terms of score. And of course you get your super awesome um, high score achievement setup. Alright, so let's see. Um, sadly to say, no special notes attached to this one. Um, this plate is definitely one of Cheryl's best support plates out there at this point in time. So if you guys are Cheryl fans, definitely you will want to get it for the illustration and its skills. If you're a high score player and you don't have any fantastic star element plates that have these um, stock, uh, life skill supports, you definitely want to try and get one either Basara's or Cheryl's, whichever you prefer. And of course, if you don't have one of these um, in general just for um, you know general use, you definitely want to try and obtain one at least. Alright, since both of the episode plates are of the star element um, you know, uh, condition, either one is fine or maybe you might want to wait for a future diva that will probably have the same kind of setup for the episode plate and of course uh, if it's under your favorite diva uh, selection as well. Alright, so we're gonna do one template pool for this one because, well, I, I just want to make sure that I gain an episode plate for the costume points for Cheryl's costume so maybe I can unlock it in the future slowly. I don't really have the need to actually get it straight away so let's do this guys. Alright, so the last few pulls that I did for Basara was pretty pathetic, so maybe there is some luck with Cheryl's this time round, so let's do this. Okay, I was wrong. <laughs> so if only one plane and only one red box on the first appearance, okay, we do get three. I don't know, maybe we'll get an evolution of a box, but you know, since... We've seen the first red box not evolving. I have a feeling that the other two will not do so as well. But that's fine. Um, secret boards are always welcome. You know, getting those luck panels are fantastic. Okay, so we're skipping all the common stuff. Lots of jellyfish Freya. Oops, I kind of fast forward on that, but that's fine. As you can tell that uh, it didn't evolve. So, yeah. Right here we go, the last red box, not evolving as well. Oh, we do get, I think this is a brand new plate, so it is re related to uh, Cheryl's new costume. So that's fine for me. Alright, here we go, Boop. there we go, we get the information panel that we have costume points for Cheryl's brand new costume. And of course, uh, that's pretty much what I was aiming for. I wasn't really aiming for getting uh, maybe a, the exclusive 
5 star plate, I just really wanted to be able to unlock Cheryl's costume gradually. Um, it would have been awesome if we did get 5 star plates, uh, but you know, considering the luck factor that um, Uta Macross has, um, it would have been a very big miracle if we did get a 5 star plate at this point in time. But I guess, in a way, it's good because I'm conserving my luck for future gachas, uh, hopefully for rankas, and I'll get probably her exclusive 5 star plate uh, in the future gachas to come. Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching as always. Hopefully you guys find the information I share as useful as always. Do let me know by hitting the like button for this video. Subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed just yet. And I'll see you guys in the future gacha video. Until then, bye!